All right, it's day two of the Alex Trebek estate sale. The Jeopardy show host died from cancer in 2020. Today, the long lines were as long as day one. Fox 11's Hal Eisner is back there. He was able to get inside the Studio City mansion today to give us all a look. The Trebek family home, it's big. It's about 10,000 square feet. There are five bedrooms. There's nine or so bathrooms. And right now, there's a whole lot of people inside buying memorabilia during day two of an estate sale. That's what I came here for. Artwork, under the chandelier, fine china. Some plates are damaged, maybe from a fall off the table. It doesn't it, mean it has no value. It means it has a great story. But you know what, they were Alex's. Alex's home, the views, spectacular. The pool and jacuzzi, <laughs> inviting. Looking out a front window, you can see all the people waiting in line to get in and do what all these people are doing, shop for memories. Here in Alex Trebek's personal theater room, where they sit around and watch movies and sit in these chairs, even the chairs are for sale. Uh, the price tag on this, $750. That's for each chair. This piece of art, Beachmaster, sealed by Alexander Schick, $750. But the walls are covered in all kinds of paintings and drawings and mixed media. This one here, $695. Bucks. But for many of these people, it's not about the money. It's about the man. You really liked this guy, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> what was it about him? No, I just saw uh, someone who's super genuine and wholesome and, um, yeah, just real. College student Jasmine Maldonado wanted a Trebek magazine on First Lady Jacqueline Kennedy. You want to learn more about her? Yeah. And this is an opportunity. Exactly. This piece, fashioned after Trebek, will find a new home with Disney animator Kevin McLean. Price? 450 bucks. Is that 450 worth every penny? Oh, definitely, yeah. Why? Well, he's just a TV icon. And then there's this painting in the Trebek dining room. It looks like Alex Trebek. At least it does to Dia Abruzzo, who bought it and took it home. The estate sale continues over the weekend. Expect lines on Fryman and Laurel Canyon near Ventura Boulevard, with so many fans wanting, if nothing else, just to spend a minute inside the home where Alex Trebek lived. In Studio City, I'm Hal Eisner, Fox 11 News.